Eagles Lane Johnson raves about Jalen Hurts' leadership, new OC Kellen Moore. Last season, Lane Johnson and the Philadelphia Eagles got off to a 10-1 start before proceeding to lose five of their final six regular season games. To cap it off, they were blown out by the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in the NFC wildcard round, 32-9. Inevitably, head coach Nick Sirianni and quarterback Jalen Hurts received the brunt of the blame for the team's collapse, but that criticism doesn't shake Philadelphia's franchise Sigma Caller, according to his right tackle. On the latest edition of All Facts No Breaks, Johnson detailed what he loves about Hurts' mentality. I think Jalen handles it, the outside drama, in a very mature way. He's spoken when he needs to be. He's got a real tight bond with his teammates, Johnson told host Keyshawn Johnson. I think Jalen, with his work ethic and how he prepares himself, I think that speaks volumes, and a lot of times with guys in the building, talk doesn't go a long way, it's more actions and how you work every day. He's got that down. I know he's anxious to get this season started, just a tremendous worker, and I think even this offseason, he has heard some of the stuff that's been said, and he's made a conscious effort to get closer with his teammates, maybe the best offseason he's had since he's been an Eagle. Hertz has been a pro bowler in each of the past two seasons and rushed for an average of 716.3 yards and 12.7 touchdowns in each of the last three, but his 2023 campaign underwhelmed in comparison to his 2022 campaign. Hertz threw nine more interceptions, six in 2022 and 15 in 2023, and his passer rating dropped by 12.4 points. 101.5 in 2022 and 89.1 in 2023. Philadelphia's offense ranked third in the NFL in total yards, 389.1, and points, 28.1, per game in 2022, when it reached Super Bowl 57. Last season, the Eagles ranked eighth in total yards, 354.4, and seventh in points, 25.5, per game. Six-time All-Pro center Jason Kelsey retired after the 2023 season, meaning Philadelphia will have a new Week 1 center for the first time since 2011. Johnson, who started on the same offensive line as Kelsey for 11 years, labeled the center not being at OTAs as weird. With the disappointing finish to 2023 came changes to Sirianni's coaching staff, as the Eagles hired a new offensive and defensive coordinator. On the offensive front, Philadelphia hired former Dallas Cowboys, 2019-22, and Los Angeles Chargers, 2023, offensive coordinator Kellen Moore, who Johnson is impressed with. Kellen brings a dynamic offense, Johnson said. His offenses have put up a lot of points over the years. I remember watching Dallas when he was there. He knew when to go tempo. He knew when to implement the quick game, and then he knew when to, obviously, run the ball. I've seen Zeke run the ball many times on us. I feel like he has a good feel of the game. And, obviously, him as a player, achieving what he achieved, just the right mind. Seeing that during OTAs, you can feel this guy knows what he's doing. Already armed with wide receivers AJ Brown and Devonta Smith on the outside, Moore's offense now includes running back and two-time pro bowler Saquon Barkley, who the Eagles signed to a three-year, $37.8 million contract. Under Moore, the Cowboys offense led the NFL in total yards twice, 2019 and 2021, was first in points in 2021 and fourth in points in 2022. That said, the Chargers had a disappointing season under Moore in 2023, averaging just 329.4 total yards, 18th, and 20.4 points, 21st, per game. Johnson, 34, is a two-time All-Pro and five-time Pro Bowler who has spent his entire NFL career with the Eagles.